hi guys welcome back to my channel as you can see I have everything set up I'm about to cook one of my hello fresh meals I picked the melty Monterey Jack burgers I'll show you a picture it's right here does not look so good <laughs> anyway so I have everything all prepped on the back of this card it tells you like all the steps and stuff and it tells you what you need to have out so yes I have two bowls I have my salt I have the large pan and all of that so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and get started and start cooking this I think it's really cool and this is the hello fresh app and right here you can see the burgers doesn't it look good on the the app Hopefully it'll focus so you can see it, but yeah. <laughs> I was sold with that picture. You get to pick what meals you want, so yeah, I picked that. But I thought this was cool. My phone's about to die, but it says cook it. I feel like it's the same thing that's on the back of the, the paper, but the first is like step by step, which is really cool, especially if you're not familiar with cooking. You don't cook often. But I think this is cool. I mean, if you want to like impress your new date or something your new boyfriend girlfriend <laughs> it's a step by step she'll never know if you just whip out your phone and just read the steps <laughs> act like you know what you're doing anyways step two step three so it's pretty cool huh all right so yeah i just wanted to show you guys that i thought that was pretty neat so i'm gonna go ahead and get started <laughs> Okay, so here's the finished product. Looks good. So I'm gonna call Sean over here and he's gonna be my guinea pig and he's gonna give his first impressions of this multi Monterey Jack Burgers. So let me go ahead and put the lid on this. <laughs> it looks like <laughs> there's dinner, babe. It's all small. <laughs> I mean, it's not a small burger. I mean, kind of is, but is it's just a, like this serving on here. It's like, ooh, look at all this food. I think they have a much smaller plate. Well, they, I think they also. Oh. Well, it's like half off. <laughs> With all the uh, the cheese and the mayonnaise. Yeah. Looks good though. You want to try it? Okay. So, should we try the zucchini? Oh. Hurry up, because my phone's, my camera's dying. It just started oh. dying. 
They are? No, it's really good. Let me try one of mine. Um, like the seasoning. The zucchini itself doesn't really have much of a flavor, but the seasoning and everything is really good. Yeah, it is. I mean, if you're going to eat zucchini, I mean, I'd yeah. rather have it like this. It nice. is really good. It's delightful. <laughs> Let me try the burger. Okay. Right. It looks small in your big mm. man hands. I'm trying to take like dainty bites. <laughs> what do you think? It's really good. So the the onions don't really have seem like they add like they don't overpower like onions usually do. Mm -hmm. It's definitely the the cheese. It's, de <laughs> it's definitely the cheese. It is definitely the cheese. <laughs> no, it's it's really cheesy. So the the Monterey Jack cheese. It's definitely like the predominant flavor. I don't really taste much of the balsamic vinegar. He likes his meat pink. Yeah. That's why it's pink. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> Shut um, I don't like, I, I'm typically not a big fan of like the overly juicy burgers. Uh -huh. Like when you pick it up and it's smart ass like sauce flopping all over the place and stuff. Mm. But it is good. It's really flavorful. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, so anyways, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to have dinner. So... And I'll go ahead and give you guys my first impression after I'm finished eating, and then I will be back to let you guys know my final thoughts. A few moments later. All right, so my final thoughts on the Monterey Jack Burger is, eh, we were talking about it, and we think it just needed more flavor. Like, it just needed to be turned up a couple notches, didn't it? Like yeah. it. Like it wasn't horrible. It was definitely better than like your average burger. But like I thought I was gonna like eat it and like just be like blown like away with flavor and it was just very, very like mute. It was crazy. I expected that kind of from the zucchini, but the burger with the um, onion jam, I was really expecting like a like a punch in the face with flavor, like I don't know, it was kind of disappointing. It was really good though, like the meat was really good. Like the quality of everything was really, like it was outstanding. What do you think, Sean? I would agree with that. I feel like I expected a lot more flavor than what we got. The hamburger quality was good, the cheese was good, the bun was really good. The recipe itself, I could tell it was good, but I feel like it just didn't have like that extra bit. Like I really would say it was kind of, I don't know, would I prefer that over like a Wendy's double or like an In-N-Out burger? Probably not. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. I mean, it was good, but <laughs> for the amount of work and everything that you have to do to prep it and do all this stuff, I don't know. I mean, like you did it all, but to me, it just seemed like it was- it What, was like chopping the- kind of a less hamburger. True. I mean, yeah, chopping all the, um, the minced garlic and zucchini. And, and not only that, but like for the, the amount you get just wasn't, it wasn't enough. I mean, I'm not, I'm full. I didn't eat all day though. Well, you're a small person. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How does the man feel? I, I eat my feelings. <laughs> but I don't think Hello Fresh does man sized portions. Um, but for your regular person, and believe me, I'm a pig right now. Like, you're not a pig right now. Sean. <laughs> um, I don't know, maybe my stomach shrunk because I haven't eaten all day because I knew I was going to make this. Um, it was pretty filling. Like I'm satisfied. Like I'm not potential. hungry. I'm not overly stuffed. It's perfect. Yeah, it had potential. But I feel like if you're like a ravenous person that just eats a lot of food, like believe me, like a basic adult. <laughs> um, I don't know. Like maybe get the four uh, people sized dinners and have two burgers instead of one. But yeah. Or if you're a single person, just buy the two people, of course, obviously. But, okay, so yeah, that was... They need to make a barbarian size. <laughs> Shine. <laughs> My only complaint, which is kind of a big deal, was they forgot the balsamic vinegar in my order. Like, this is everything that comes in your little bag for that recipe. And yeah, they forgot the important balsamic balsamic vinegar for the onion jam. So 
I had to get Sean to run out and get me some. And bless his heart, he went to Stater Brothers, which is a grocery store here in California. And I told him to get me balsamic vinegar and he comes back with salad dressing, balsamic vinegar. And I was like, Sean. Balsamic vinegar at <laughs> girl balsamic. Mm -hmm. So yeah, then he had to run to Target because Stater Brothers was then closed. And Tar Target's a little bit further and doing his duties of the dishes. <laughs> so yeah, Target's a bit further, so that was a pain in the ass. So that was like, how much, how many minutes? Like 40 minutes? At least. Yeah, so I had to like stop everything, stop everything that I was doing and wait for him to come back with the balsamic vinegar because my next step was making those onions right there, so. But yeah, they had actually like really easy to follow instructions. Yeah, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I want to add. The cleanup sucks. <laughs> Sean. <laughs> I burned some cheese on the pan, so the poor thing's scrubbing it right now. Anyways, uh, the convenience of it, it was nice. It was nice to like have an idea what I was going to make for dinner without even having to like really think about it and everything was just right there in that bag for me and ready for to go so oh yeah for the most part right I know like if the balsamic vinegar was in there but yeah I'm I'm pleased it was nice I mean it wasn't like uh Gordon Ramsay was here cooking me a burger do you know what I mean like Oh thank you Sean <laughs> But yeah, uh, it was it was good. I just feel like the flavor could have been kicked up a notch. That's about it. I don't know, I'm, I'm curious to see what the other ones taste like. Yeah, but anyways you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will be posting videos weekly. So yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye. Say bye, Sean. Love.